Hello again, I'm Toby, and welcome back to Oxygen Not Included. And I think I realized why the research tables are losing power so quickly. It's because I have these batteries attached to these, which are always going to be diffusing oxygen because we always have a lot of people. That reminds me, we really have to watch, start watching our algae. Yeah, that's how you say it. Algae consumption. And, um... Yeah, we just need to start watching our algae consumption. We could mine down here to... Actually, yeah, that's not that bad of an idea. I think I'll do that. <laughs> some ladders up in here it's like and that's priority nine otherwise they'll like dig themselves into a hole not the brightest but they're nice Good. Plus, one of them falls down there, which I'm sure someone will. We got plenty of oxygen. See down there, boys, that's algae. You gotta get that stuff to survive. So, uh, mine it. That stuff, you, you don't gotta worry about that stuff. No, cancel. There we go. There we go. And then this, I wanna mine this out just to make it even. <laughs> Cause I'm kind of nitpicky like that. Only a little bit. Mmm. Yeah, I had Ari wear that nice suit, or whatever it's called. Stop complaining, okay? I'll work on it. I mean, at least it goes straight into the polluted water reservoir. So that's not horrible. I guess. We're gonna wanna get these guys out of there. Oh, he's elderly. He's... Oh no, there's a... <sighs> there's an egg down there. Oh. Stop peeing everywhere! Everyone just learn a skill points left to right. Is that a good day for them? So, what I like to do, I've, ever since I've gotten this massive water bottle, I, I, I brought it into class one day and a teacher was like, that ain't even a water bottle. I don't care. I don't care what you say, that that's not even a water bottle. Because it's so big. It holds over 30,000. See, am I reading that right? No, 30 hundred milliliters. 30,000 would be like 10 times of this. That would be insane. That would not be a water bottle. That would be like full blown water reservoir. Three thousand. Yeah, three thousand. Three thousand milliliters. Eh. Ooh. Got no duplicates. Or 
Maybe other stuff. Cause Oh, bristleberry. They could eat well for a good hour or two. <laughs> um Anyway, so what I've liked to do with this big jug is because it's so big, I like to make entire pots of Kool-Aid inside of it. And just carry it around with me. And I got the idea originally when one of my friends just straight up dumped a thing of a like you know that lemonade flavoring stuff that you just tear it off and you pour it in a water bottle. He poured like seven of those in there. And I enjoyed it because I really like pink lemonade. But so I started doing the Kool-Aid thing and it's a lot of Kool-Aid. It's awesome. <laughs> Start digging these guys up too. And like maybe do that. Um no, I'm no scientist. Oh no, you guys are already sick. Poor Ari. What's that? Did you kill something? <gasps> oh, research complete. Okay. Hmm. That is water sea. An algae distillery is really dangerous. And I for one really don't like it. Cause it's just that dangerous. Um See what it does is it takes slime and it turns it into algae, which is really good for when you're running out of algae. Which we probably will be in a bit. But slime has slime lung on it. And that's fatal. And it's hard to treat. Because it gets everywhere. It gets everywhere and it's... It's bad. So yeah, I like to... Not... Go to LJ Distillers for as long as I possibly can. Okay, let's see how much that takes. 120. It'd be a thousand... 1080. I can do basic math. 1080. I think that's too much for these little baby... Yeah. It is. Dang it, so we are. Gonna need to like flash research these guys. Dang. Thank you so much, Ari. Lindsay, you gem. Y'all are gems. Hope you know that. I remember this one time. I was playing this game. Duh. And... I was panicking because I was running out of oxygen. And... Like... Oh, and I was running out of algae, so therefore I was running out of oxygen. So I started running around panicking. I started digging all the way through these purple biomes and just mining up all the algae that I could find just to bring back and fuel these oxygen diffusers. Stupid <sighs> algae sucking lifeless machines. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going for here, but it wasn't. It's not good. It's not good. These mach machines are so inefficient compared to alternatives. Alternatives that I will show to you soon.
Fußball. First. Oh yeah, we got a ton of algae. Eight tons actually. But that's still like a top priority that we definitely need to take care of at some point. Just not right now. Because <laughs> I'm lazy. And not confronting issues is my strongest suit. So, what we need to do is, uh, we need to put a liquid pump right there. And then that will be the intake. Like that. See? Super easy, I know. <laughs> and... You know, ideally I need to find a better system for accessing all of this because one of these pipes could burst or something and so or something goes horribly wrong. And... I need to get to it? That's not gonna... It's not gonna be very good. Okay, and then so this is the good, healthy liquid outtake. That can be canceled. What's that? Oh, jumbo batteries and switches. Cool. Um. Oh no! Wait. Cancel that. That. Oh no, not liquid bridge. That has to go up here because this has to go down here to be a liquid output. And hmm. I don't want manual generators everywhere because that would just be highly inefficient. We'd have duplicates running everywhere, trying to run everything, and it just wouldn't end well. So ideally what we need is to get like a coal generator or a new uh, yeah, nuclear gas, um, a natural gas generator, something like that, for the time being, because hopefully we'll break pa we'll be able to advance far enough that we'll break past all that, go to the surface, because there is a surface, and then make power... Um, not horrible for environment and just wasting materials that could be used elsewhere. Yes, thank you. Please get rid of all the exclamation points. They bother me. Ah, thank you. How much does a coal generate? Requirements, coal. Thank you. 20 grams per second. A thousand grams. Oh no, 20 grams of carbon dioxide per second. That's a lot. Hmm. Six hundred watts. Is that a second? 
Is that per second? Uh, all I ask is that you don't pee in the water supply. Or supply. Source. This place. Don't pee there. Oh, that's... Can I not make it? Oh. That's unfortunate. Well... Well, someone can just eat those. Okay, so this also does raise a question where I want the bathrooms to be. Now, I want the bathrooms to be... Oh. You know what, I'm gonna tab out of that for a second, because I want to think about this. So... Um... I want the bathrooms to be easily accessible by everyone, so... Over here is actually pretty good. But bathrooms elsewhere should also be desirable um i'm thinking maybe like th a section up here be a bathroom area there'd be a door here that you could only go th through that way so i wouldn't have to build two sinks and waste materials Wait. Mm, too close for my liking. Okay. So, what I'm thinking is a door. You can only go through that way. And, or well, you can come in through that way, but the sink will be right here at the end. So, that would make, and it'll be right here. Maybe two. Um, let's see, showers are tall. I need spaces open for that. So, let me go ahead and, no, cancel. Plumbing. Shower. One, two, three, four. Are the lavatories tall too? No, they aren't. Hmm. Oh, I don't want to get closer to that. How close are we already? Oh, I don't like that. Not one bit, because these are like germ conductors. It's stupid. And most of the time they are. I'm doing pretty good, actually. Most of the time, mark my word. If I put this wall right here, there's going to be slime lung germs all over it. So I won't do that. <laughs> Um, oh, I can deconstruct the tile. Then. Mm, nah, just, just there and there. <laughs> and, um, Oh yeah, also deconstruct the ladder too. Did I turn my timer on? I didn't. 
Oh, crap. Well, I accidentally let this episode go a bit long. But that's besides the point. Because in the end, the kind of stuff doesn't really matter. But regardless, I hope you have a wonderful time whenever or wherever you are. And make sure to compliment the next person you see. It's a challenge. Do it. Or I'll... I don't know. I'll do something. And boy, will you regret it. <laughs> See you later.